How's it going everybody? Lucian Sword here, back again, playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. And I am super excited because we are continuing our Tin to Diamond series. Now this is episode number two, so if you missed the first episode where we started in Tin, you can go ahead and check that out. But we are starting at uh, about 11.17 ELO today. And in the first video, I played the entire top row of Legends because... We are playing each legend in order. Every single time I win a game, I go to the next legend. And if I lose a game, I have to keep playing that legend until I win with that legend. All right, so we are starting with Azuri today. And uh, hopefully we'll go across this entire row of legends today and get all the way to Nyx. That's a lot of games to play, so let's go ahead and get started. If you guys are super excited for this series, please drop a like and be sure to subscribe to not miss any episodes. All right, here we go. First game, Azuri versus Jiro. Both of us have Sword. He has a Scythe and I have Katar. So I'm going to try to get up close and personal and start comboing as fast as I can with these Katars. And hopefully just not get hit by his sword. Now the good thing is, Jiro doesn't have a lot of defense. So as long as I can hit him a bit, he should die pretty fast. Uh, but the problem is, he has very good attacks otherwise. Like he has pretty good signatures. So I just got to be careful about that. Oh, he got dunked. Dunk. Dunk. I'm going to let him get a weapon. But to be honest, usually after the first, uh, the first stock, I usually don't allow getting weapons oh I'm lagging but he disconnected anyways I have a feeling the legs not gonna bother us too much at this rank anyways all right well very first game and it's a disconnect unfortunately that's gonna happen but let's just go ahead and finish off this Jiro and good night all right, well, that was game one. I hope I don't keep lagging. And we got silver! Oh, feels good. So we are back to silver. We're still not back to where a brand new account starts at, which is actually 1200 ELO. So we're still like a brand new account who's lost a few games. So that's where we're at. But we are very close to getting back to that neutral position of 1200 ELO. And from there, we're only going up, baby. All right, we got Baraza versus Sidra. Very nice. I got blasters and axe, and Sidra has cannon and sword. Got to watch out for Sidra's signatures. That sword down sig will surprise you sometimes how fast it comes out and just how much power it has. And then her cannonball, the neutral sig on cannon is just, it seems like it's slow and not that good, but it's actually really good because people just tend to go right into it. Like a moth to the flame, baby. All right, Sidra. I know you, you want a weapon, but at the same time, you keep throwing away your weapon, so. And one down, Sig. Oh, there it is. Oh, she survived. Ooh, she got out of that. Bro, I should probably just... There we go. I was going to say, we got to take out this stock before she damages us anymore or else I'm not going to get a three stock. Not that I'm really trying to get three stocks. We're just trying to win. And uh, if you didn't see my first episode, the whole purpose of doing this tin to diamond is just so you guys can kind of see what it's like to play in every single rank and that journey, basically. For those of you that might not be able to do the same thing, this is what it looks like for me to do it. Okay, she... Uh, she she rage quit. I think it's because I wasn't letting her get back on stage. But, guys, that's the whole point of this game. Don't let them get back on stage. Don't feel bad doing that. Um, she could have dodged. She could have tried getting... Like, when you're trying to get back on stage, you have to do it differently. You can't just, like, glide towards the stage and not change direction or jump or dodge or anything. You have to try to be hard to read. Don't be predictable, basically. If you're predictable getting back on stage, you will get punished by good player. Oh my gosh, she could have punished me right there. See, that's the that's the down sick. No, my goodness, I don't want to. I don't want to die to a bot. Let's just go ahead and. Oh my gosh, I missed. Oh no 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 no. Okay, that's that's a three stock. I almost died to the bot. GG though. 
I hope we can get a game where they don't rage quit. Last time, like, only one or two people rage quit. This time, the first two have been two, two rage quit, so. Let's see uh, if game three will be a rage quit. This time we have Ember, and Ember has bow and katars. I love playing Ember. She's one of my most fun, like, she's one of the most fun legends to play. She just, the way she moves, her speed, her weapons, her signatures are fun. Easy to spam, I know, but Ember does have low defense, so like her her signatures are also pretty easy to punish. Alright, I'm letting him get a weapon. Just because I consider it good honor to do that. After the game starts though, like I don't give away free weapons. I could do that all day probably. Because he doesn't seem to ha <laughs> I set myself up. He doesn't want, seem to want to dodge this neutral sig. Like, Ember Neutral Sig on Bow is super good. I don't need to spam it, but since you have it, you might as well use it. And he's not really even getting a position for me. Again, another quit? Okay, well, we are in silver, so I mean, it's kind of expected, but it's disappointing at the same time. I would like to play a full match. I understand they don't want to get like bullied. Look at this, I'm even lagging like terribly. It shows I have green bars, but you guys can see I'm lagging pretty bad here. Sometimes. But yeah, like if you're getting dominated like by somebody, just try to do your best. And, and even if you lose, you know, then you could even watch the replay and see how they were doing it. And just try to copy. All right, well, that was Ember. Sadly, we only got to play one stock from a real person, but there we go. All right, moving it along, we have Azoth. Oh, I actually have a skin for this one. I am on my alternate account, guys. Obviously, I have a main account with tons of skins and everything. That's my main account, Lucian Sword. This is my alt account. I only play my alt account when I'm doing videos like this where I need to go back to a really low rank. Because it takes a long time to derank from like diamond to down to tin. I would, it would literally take me hours uh, on my main account. But on my alt account, he was already like only 1300 elo. So it didn't take long at all to get down to tin. All right. Um, I'm going to let him get a weapon. We got another Zariel. This one is Unruffled Lists 14. That's such a strange name. It's like one of those pre-generated names or something. All right. This axe is just... Oh, okay, that ground pound is working, and he he notices, so he just keeps trying to do it more and more. Oh, I thought he actually got back. He looked like he touched the wall, but I guess not. Azoth is a super fun legend. Oh, that would have been beautiful. Oh, well. I actually tried doing the gravity cancel. It didn't work. Look, this guy's not quitting. Respect. Ouch. I love Azoth though because his signatures are kind of unique. There's not really another legend that has signature like that. Uh, the side sig hits really far away and hard to punish basically. And then the down sig also surprises people like that on the bow. He just has good signatures in my opinion. Good stats, good weapons. Just a good weapon in, or a good legend in general Azoth is. Ouch. Oh my goodness. Nobody's actually taken like a legit stock off us like ever since we've started this 10 to diamond. And I was wondering like at what rank somebody's actually going to get a legit stock off us. I say legit because I did kill myself like once. I don't count that one. I'm talking like somebody actually KOs me. Hasn't happened once yet. I'm pretty sure. Unless I'm forgetting. All right. Well, he didn't quit. So I give him mad respect. Thumbs up on that, dude. Thank you for not quitting. All right, let's keep it going. We're going to play Koji next, and I have a couple skins, including Shinsekai, which I think I'm going to use. Let's use uh, Shinsekai and Soulfire. Oh, that is such a good-looking skin, and the Soulfire color is from Battle Pass Season 1. It was the very first Battle Pass, and uh, this was the color scheme that you could get from it. Never again, I guess, will you be able to get this color scheme. 
apparently my alt account i got like a few levels on the battle pass so i was i got the uh color for like a few random legends all right, we're going against a uh, glitz, glitzy sniper playing Sidra again. Is Sidra popular at this rank? Cause like I never see Sidra very much at all in any rank. She's not a bad legend though. Like Sidra is actually really good. If you like sword and uh, cannon, sh like I said, she has amazing signatures. Not so much that signature, but. All right, this guy's actually going like ne dead even with us. Oh, don't do it again. See, people in low rank, they just don't want to accept that they're not going to be able to, like, fall down on top of me. Even if you hit them with a the signature over and over and over, they just keep wanting to fall on top of you. And All right, he's starting to learn, but even now. See, he did—he ground pound again. I could have just... He needs to learn to uh, not ground pound when you're trying to get back on stage. That's like the worst thing you can do unless you're actually trying to hit with it. And now we got another rage quit. I'm not keeping count, but I think so far only one person didn't rage quit. Which is kind of a bummer because last episode, like I said, only a few did. That's okay. Maybe uh, people in silver are more salty than people in, in tin. Probably. People in tin really are. They're so low that they don't even care about their rank at all. They're just playing just to have fun, I probably. And once you get up to this rank, people, I guess, care. And uh, so that's why they're probably quitting more often when they think they're just going to lose. They'd rather get to the next match, I guess, than waste time losing. But the thing is, it's not a waste of time. You, you can learn a lot from losing. You can learn a lot more from losing than you can from winning uh, because it'll teach you what you're doing wrong. Especially against a player that's better. All right, this is Ulgrim. He has Axe and Lance. Let's just keep it going as quickly as possible because, like I said, we have a lot of legends to get through today. Oh, man. All right, here we go. Going against Jiro. Another Jiro. I feel like we're going against the same few legends over and over. All righty. Going against I.A. Robble. Maybe it's just A. Rob with two lines on either side. All right, he, he actually knows how to play the uh, sword, it looks like, so I gotta be careful. Usually low rank people are kind of bad against Lance. They, I feel like it's just because they don't know like what is possible with Lance, so therefore they don't know what to expect and what to do when it happens and stuff like that. I'll be honest, I was probably the same way for a long time. Alright, see he dodged behind me there when I did a side light. Dodge behind me again. Dodge behind me again. So now I'm just starting to read him. Let's see if he'll change up his dodges. It's good that he's dodging, but now he's dodging predictably the same way every time. Like, please don't. Uh, and there's another rage quit. You do one little down light into ground pound and they act like they have no chance. But yeah, don't try to dodge the same direction every single time. Like, if you get side light, dodge a different direction every time. And then they won't be able to read what you're going to do next time they do it. GG, dude. GG. All right, that was a quick match. 16 elo there. All right, let's go to Diana. Ooh. Let's give her a cool bow, though. Let's give her that bow. Diana is one of my favorite legends just because she's fun to play. Like, she's got two moves that do, like, the whip around attack, the, the blaster down sig, and the bow down sig. And those are just fun moves to hit. And in a 1v1, if you hit them, they can't get out of it. They can't really punish it. In a 2v2, Diana's not as good because she can get punished really easily easily when she's in the middle of doing her signatures. Um, we're going against Nesbio 03. Gonna let him have that weapon. All right, he's actually like winning right now, but if he's just gonna spam six like that, I think we're, we have a good chance to win.
Oh, oh, oh. Please don't kill me first stock. No. I'm not gonna lose to Taros. Oh, that, he should have not done that. There it is. <laughs> I knew he was gonna try to get close to me and I'll just whip him. All right, this guy is actually not bad. Like, he's the first person to even get us close to taking us out, so mad respect. That was actually really close, that ground pound. Oh my gosh. I don't want to lose a stock. Oh, right in the mine? Nope. No, 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 no. So close. What are you doing with that bomb, Taros? Oh, how did I not do a down light? Oh, I tried to catch it. No. Don't get hit from that Bob Taros. This is a this is a nail biter. Oh, GG dude, GG. At least he didn't quit. He like gave up. Or, I mean, he did not give up. Like he wanted to fight that whole time. Respect. All right, that was Diana. We're halfway through. Let's keep going. We got to do Jala. There was actually somebody who commented in the last video that they were excited for the series or something and they couldn't wait for me to play their legend who was Jala. So this one is for you. I forget who your name was, but oh my goodness. Do we did we just find a Smurf? This guy has a really good looking Arcadia skin. He's got the frosted title. He's got the saw blade from uh, Mako. I don't remember the skin name, but all right. Whether they're good, we don't know, but they definitely spend money on the game. Not that that's a bad thing or anything. Ooh, zero to death on the fancy looking Arcadia. I gotta say, now I know how, how it feels when you don't have like very many skins or any skins. And you run into somebody with an awesome skin. It's, uh, it's a little bit intimidating. I like to call it the skin intimidation factor. What a dodge. Ooh. I can't wait till I get to play Arcadia because right now she's like my favorite legend. Yeah, you want to keep trying that? I didn't think so. <laughs> I was hoping she would do a recovery. GG, dude, GG. All right, let's move on to core. Mm. I kind of want to do default colors core. Uh, let's give him the shield gaunt uh, gauntlets and then the, the yokai smash hammer, I guess. I don't have a lot of options for skins, like I said. Um, these skins I only got because they were free. I think like Some of you might be wondering like do I buy skins on two different accounts? Not really. I just get like a lot of extra codes I mean I give away codes every single video guys every single video I drop codes in the comments So if you're new to the channel definitely subscribe and when you see a new video come out You got to click on it immediately so that you can look in the comments Well, so you can watch the video But also so you can look in the comments see if you can get one of those free codes. I'm always dropping Ooh, that's that's a stock right there. That's kind of a simple uh, string that I did there, but if you're not familiar with it, it's uh, easy to die from. A lot of the low rank uh, reasons why they die is they're just not familiar with all the combos and, and strings. Gosh, this song is always so loud. I gotta turn it down. 
It's way louder than every other song in, in the game. Basically just did it to him again, but that time he didn't get hit. Actually, I don't want the gauntlets. I wanted to try a hammer. Ooh, nice throw. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do the mafia. Yokai smash. GG dude, GG. I'm sorry that you had to get bodied like that, but it's for education. So we're beyond the neutral point, which is 1200 ELO. So if you're at this point, that means that you actually won some games on off of a brand new account. So we are in the positive now. All right, now I can turn the music back to where it usually is. For some reason, it's just that stage is so loud. Ooh, a Goldforge Wushong versus a Genie Wushong. Uh, a Jin Wushong. Let's see how, how it goes. Demon Island, one of my favorite maps. Gonna give him a taunt. Good luck, good luck. All right, I'm gonna let him get a weapon. Don't know how I grabbed him off the ground like that. Oh, I'm feeling a little bit of leg, but not that bad. Kind of surprised that hit him, but... Oh my goodness, the leg. I'll let him get a weapon. He seems to be uh, a little nervous without it. See, he dodged a different direction that time, and it actually... Allowed him to knock it. Wait. Okay, if I lose my first stock because of lag, I'm going to be disappointed. And I, I don't even know if I'll count that. Probably we have to. Oh, man. I hit him so hard with that down sig that he actually <laughs> died by going off the ceiling. Nope! Don't want to die. Don't want to die. Oh my snipe. Still alive, bro? What you gonna do? Oh. Oh! The perfect punish and the first time somebody got a stock on me is right now JMC1192. Congrats. Of course, now you gotta lose. Cause I am on a mission and we're getting diamond. GG dude, GG. That move is so good. That down sig on gauntlets just kind of sucks them in and spits them out. Well played, dude. Well played. He actually got stock. Mad respect. All right, let's keep it going. This time, Val. But we're gonna go Stevani. For some reason, I have Stevani skin on this. That is amazing. Actually, that I know you guys want to see that lock in animation. Let's, like, yoing. So cool, right? All right, here we go. Go in against a Nyx. Exotic tab. Interesting name. I'm thinking of like a chrome tab. You got something exotic in that chrome tab? All right, here we go. I'm still getting a little bit of lag every now and then, but it's not to the point yet where I think it's going to matter. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I actually love Stevani. I just don't play Val that much. This guy is actually pretty good uh, for a silver. I don't know if he's a smurf or not, but it feels like it. 
Yeah, don't go down the death pit against the gauntlet user, man. That's going to be a death wish every time. One of the awesome things about Val is her SIGs have multiple uses. Like, you see how I'm going up the wall and I'm going down the wall. I'm going along the ground. Three different ways to use a side SIG. Pretty awesome. Oh my goodness, we're getting in the rhythm now. No rage quit? Oh, there's the rage quit from Exotic Tab. Man, probably like half of our games, at least half have been rage quit, right? Feels bad, feels bad. But I figured it would happen at this rank, guys. It even happens in high rank, so. Gosh, the bot? They're kind of hard to hit sometimes. Like, the way they float around is not like a human. All right, please don't lose to the bot. And that should be game, right? Stay down, Nyx. GG, GG. All right, where are we at? We're at 1293. We're at silver four. That's pretty good. And we're on Ragnar, so we got four more games. No problem, guys. No problem. If you've made it with me this far in the video, guys, thank you so much for watching this far. It really, really helps the channel to watch a long video. So thank you a lot. All right. Going against Zavosity. Hmm. Here we go. Three, two, He's uh, Bodvar. So far, we haven't lost the game. We've only lost one stock. But we are in silver. I imagine we may lose a game, though, if we come up against another smurf. Very possible. Like I said, I'm not a pro. I'm just just a 23-time diamond. And since we are playing every single legend in order, I'm not really getting warmed up to one legend in particular. But that's why I like the challenge. Yeah, keep doing that. I got a perfect counter, right? He kind of went right into that. Oh my goodness. Rage quit after one stock. You will never get high rank if you rage quit on one stock. The game is just getting started. I <laughs> got it with that. Last game. All right. Ragnar was a very short game. And that put us over 1,300. All right. We're making good progress. Now we got Cross. Ooh. We got an Artemis. Artemis is actually... We got to be careful. Artemis side sig is really good on both Lance and uh, Scythe. So it can come out fast. So I really don't want to die to that. Ooh, she, she coming out swinging. I like it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, there's that side stick I told you about. Oof, get punched so hard. Boom. If I hit her once with the side sig and she's in orange health, like, she dead. That was close. Oh, that side sig again. No, I knew I was going to die from that Lance side sig on Artemis. All right, well, there's another stock gun. That's okay. I wanted to use the blasters anyway. Nope. We're going to outrange her with these blasters every time. Ha, 
I didn't actually think that I was going to grab it first, but it did. All right, final stock for Artemis. Oh, don't keep ground pounding. Took her three tries uh, to ground pound into the flames to realize that maybe that's not a good idea. Oh my goodness. This is the closest anybody's got to killing us twice. And she might. Ah, oh, so close, so close. GG, GG. We're actually starting to get into the rank of people who know how to play a little bit, little bit better, which I guess is gold rank. All right, now we're going to Mirage. And I love that site, so we're gonna, I don't have a lot of options on Spear, unfortunately. All right. And yes, guys, I will be dropping codes in the comments after this uh, video. I was going to say match, but we got one more match after this, I believe. So definitely hold on until the end of the video, and I will be dropping codes. All right, here we go. Rald of... I, I don't even know what that name is. Raldofermany. Okay, and uh, playing Sir Roland, and we have Mirage. Now, doesn't this spear kind of go with the Mirage? I don't know why. It just looks like it would. Too easy. Too easy, sir. Roll it. You gotta stop going it right above me. Oh my. There it is. His side light just stunned him long enough. Alright, now I gotta use some scythe, baby. I have a feeling next episode is going to be where people start being able to maybe get a win, which is basically gold. We'll see. I don't remember. I haven't been in gold in a long time, but I have a feeling that they will be able to damage me. So I'll have to play pretty good on every legend since I'm playing all legends. All right. But next video is the third row of legends. And I think I like more legends on the third row than in the top two rows. Probably just because they're newer legends, but. Oops. I really want to hit with the neutral sig on sight. That's like my favorite move. Yeah, boom, boom. Boom, boom. And one more. For the fans. Ah, I missed it. I don't know what he's doing because he's not even going for the weapon anymore. Well, GG, dude, GG. All right, guys. Last game, I think we're at Silver 5. And we're on the last game for today's episode, which is Nyx. And I have Goldforge Nyx. What? I have a Skyforge site. I didn't even know these... All right, I didn't know I had this much drip on my alt account. All right, Skyforge Nyx with a gold, with a sky, or no, Goldforge Nyx with a Skyforge Scythe. All right, actually, we should look at our rank rewards. I didn't play ranked at all on this account, I don't think, in the last season. So I probably don't have very much glory, but we should look. If I have any glory, I should buy something else. All right, last game. Oh, it's another Taros, and he's black. Okay, he's got to be halfway decent if he's got black colors, right? What you got to do, Taros? You got to take that in the face is what you're going to do. Oh my goodness. Another rage quit. 
Is it the Goldforge colors, or was it when I threw the weapon at the mine that that he just gave up? <laughs> what? Okay, bro. Um, well, that was Nyx, unfortunately. We didn't get to play her very much. So, next video, we're going to do the third row of Legends and continue our climb to Diamond from 10 to Diamond. And we're probably going to get Gold Rank very soon. So, thank you guys for watching. And as always, please drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for more videos. I hope to see you in the next one. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, friends.